The idea of the Information Trust Association is to set up a nonprofit uh, public benefit organization, probably a 501c3 or C6, C6, which would not have any stockholders, and but which would have members who would contribute money to set up protocols for managing user identity and information commerce on the web. So that instead of having an entity that uh, that the that has stockholders and which therefore everybody who isn't a stockholder is trying to compete with, you would have an entity which is globally oriented, which has members but not stockholders and therefore it can't be bought or sold, and which doesn't actually do anything itself other than specify protocols and make opt-in rules for how commerce and identity works on the web. This is the kind of private initiative that the Obama administration is supporting through its national uh, information infrastructure technology uh, initiative where it said, no, we don't want the government to issue identity cards for everybody. We want there to be lots of independent, trusted providers of identity services. And if you add to that the ability to buy and sell information on, a to on an atomic basis, then all of a sudden you have a free market for digital information. That's what the Information Trust Association intends to create.